Why are you chilling? Well, that was a bust. Oh yeah. Look at the mini pond. Check this out. Oh yeah. What is going on, girls? Welcome back to another video here. Today, look where we are. We're in the old backyard. It's so nice to be here again on camera. I come here all the time because obviously my parents live here. But uh, look at this. I'm filming again back here. It got super low. I believe there was like a little tiny piece of liner that flipped backwards like this and let water out slowly. But we're good. We're filling back up. We got our dechlorinator right here. You gotta remember, out here where my parents live is city water, meaning it needs to be dechlorinated when it's filling up something. It has chlorine in it. Where I live now, it's well water, meaning it's coming straight from the ground. There's no dechlorinator needed. It's safe for fish, safe for pretty much anything. Look at how big the gar is. Huge. The gar is massive. Look at the tilapia. The tilapia tried to eat my fingers. These are fish that Thumb just never ate. It doesn't make much sense. I put those baits in there when they were like this big for Thumb to just always have baits inside the pond. Little did I know, he actually ended up making friends with about a dozen of them. And now he doesn't even touch them, and they're all just right there. But yet, if I throw another one in, he'll eat that one. Not those, though. Those are his friends. See them all? It's so funny. Like, that's the exact bait that Thump eats. Mini pond. Look at the mini pond. So many fish. They just go all over. Look at that. Dalmatian molly right there. Beautiful fish. Oh, hi, little guy. I haven't showed you guys in a while. I'm sure you've had many babies since I've been gone. We have two uh, females and one male, Malaysian box turtles back here. There's so many places for them to hide now. Everything's so grown. I gotta come back and start filming some bangers back here. I used to film so many videos. This is literally where my channel started, right here. This backyard made countless, countless viral videos back here. Here, what do you think? What do you think, boy? Huh? There's some flakes in there and look at this thing. This pond is uh, just loaded with fish, so I pretty much load the whole surface of the pond with flakes and uh, everything eats. You can see all the fish. And there's a bunch of babies up in there. You'll see them kind of swim by. I love this place. Hey, if you want to see me film some more videos back here, hit the like button. If it gets like 15, 20,000 likes, I'll know. I gotta get my butt back over here and start filming. I wanna see something crazy, look at the koi pond. Although the landscape's all messed up from when I had the pigs back here, look at how big the koi fish got. Is that insane? Look how much dirt got to the bottom of the pond. Not that that does anything, but the pigs just got it all down. You can see the high fin down there. The high fin's chilling down there. Ready? Oh my gosh. Look how many mollies are in here. What in the heck? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Eat up. Eat up. Oh. Oh my gosh. Look how big the little ones got. These things are so small when I put them in. Oh my dark. Anyway, what I was gonna say. Today's video, as I saw by the title and thumbnail, we are going to visit uh, multiple like reptile stores. I used to do this a lot. Like for instance, look at look at all those videos. I used to do it a lot. Got a lot of views on doing this stuff. So obviously y'all love it. I haven't done it in months, absolutely like months. I'm trying to get back to those old roots, you know, do a little bit of here, do a little bit of this, you know. I know you guys miss it, so uh, here it is. I'll see you at the first store. First location, we are here. I haven't been here in a long, long time, but I'm excited. We're gonna head in there and uh, see what they got. Well, that was a bust. I got kicked out. Not allowed to film in there. Their loss, not mine. On to the next. <laughs> well, the last place kicked us out, so I drove three hours across the state to see my grandparents. Oh, How you doing, a, Pops? Oh, so doing I surprised great. them at their doorstep great. this morning. It was awesome. Uh, but now we headed over to the local fish store, and we're going to do a little tour here. I've been here once before, and this place blows my mind every time I walk here. You first walk up and, and just look. Got koi fish in the ponds up front. Look at that. Monster. Check this out. Oh, yeah. First thing is first, you got the African cichlid tank. Papa, what's your favorite fish? Oh my goodness gracious, can I show you over here? Yeah. Oh, you're right to the first tank. Yeah, I love this fish. Where is it? There he is, right here. It's a big one, right here. That is a beautiful fish, that's for sure. Look at it. he's got Kylie Jenner on. lips. Look, look. Kylie Jenner. Isn't he cool? <laughs> oh, we got the saltwater side over here too. I'm really trying to get into that saltwater stuff. I don't know. Just a small one, just a real small one. I know, that's why I said just a small one. It is a lot of work, but... I've asked them multiple times if I should get a saltwater tank, hit 50,000 likes. And every time they get to like 48,000 likes. There's just endless and endless amounts of it. I gotta take a thumbnail, oh my goodness. 
live rock. Check that out. Got a clown knife down there hiding. It's a Mayan cichlid. We catch those. Endless and endless amounts of uh, assorted African cichlids. Like, if you want African cichlids, this is the place to come. Look at, oh my goodness, look at them all. Got a bunch of little tetras over here. Frontosa. See them? Oh, come here, buddy. Look at them. Bunch of grommies, different types of grommies, blue grommies. These tanks are very, very clean. Holy moly. They do a great job on keeping up on everything. These are my favorite fish, Pops. Favorite Which fish, one? right Which here. One? Mollies and platies, oh. assorted mollies and platies. I just love the sword tails, like, look, you see the little tail on them? I love the coloration, though. There, I have a lot of these. You know the mini pond in my parents' backyard, right? Oh, yeah. It's absolutely loaded with these right here. I have a love for these fish because this is where my whole entire channel started. You know I built the first pond, and these are the fish I bought for it. And that's like, here's the thumbnails of my old videos. That's exactly where it all started. Yep. Mollies and platies. We bred them. We made there was babies everywhere. It was it was awesome. We're gonna be doing more of that soon too. Of uh, the mollies and platies breeding. I love that stuff. What makes this good? It's affordable for everybody. Young people can start in this hobby. It's not expensive. Are you meant to be a YouTuber? <laughs> I think you're meant to be on camera, Pops. Yeah, right. How old is it? How old is it? Thirty-seven. That is a thirty-seven-year-old eel. Absolutely massive. More eel. The colors are just unbelievable. One day I'll do a little tank like that. I want one. I just want to make sure y'all want one too. I'm not going to do it just for me. Oh yeah. Bumping into the salt water over here. Look how cute. These aren't any ordinary clownfish. Look how cool that is. All white. Uh huh. Those are just awesome. I want to tank with these guys. I want to do like a colorful community tank, something like that. Like I think that's cool. Just like you have. Because then it's like. It's always action. Like, look how beautiful that is. You got all sorts of different things you could buy, too. Like, there's just so many different fish. Look at that. They like to call these saltwater beta fish. See? Marine beta. Isn't that sick? 150 bucks for that fish. That's one thing about saltwater. You're going to be spending some money. You like that one? Oh, look at him. This is so, so dope. Fast. Wait, what is this? What is this? There's some little fish right there. Some more little fish back here. There's a, what the heck? It's turtles. Look at this squad of turtles. This is so dope. We're literally in a Cajun area. If I was him, I'd put like parrots back here. Wild parrots, that'd be cool. Holy, oh my God, it keeps going. We are in the tank room now. Check this out. Got used aquariums and new aquariums. This is nuts. 55s. Last time I was here, this all wasn't done. This whole side of the store wasn't done. It was just the fish side over there. Now that this is done, it's it's mind blowing how good this came out. You know, I have an albino axolotl in my house. Two of them, two of them actually. Axel and Lottle. This one right here is a large albino axolotl, $69. And look at the size of that thing. I can't wait till mine get that big. I can't really get a comparison. That's my hand next to it. Look how big, oh, it looks like it wants to bite my thumb off. Sick. Microscopic shrimps. Cherry shrimp, bamboo shrimp, all sorts of stuff down in this tank right here. I should consider doing something like that uh, later on too. That's that's a really cool uh, concept, those little tiny shrimp everywhere. But y'all, I think that's that's about it on a rundown of this pet store. Three hours across state from my house. I love doing these tours. I know last video was a tour as well. This video is a tour, but you know, tours on tours. I'm showing y'all the life that I'm living, just traveling around, filming aquarium stuff. I do have animals at the house I gotta get back to now, so I'm gonna pick up the camera when uh, I get home. The pig's gonna come right out of that bush when I start whistling, ready? <laughs> there's one. Lulu's the first one. There's Bubba. There's Pua. And there's Baloo. And then they run. My children. <laughs> you know how Larry likes to always join in and, and open his mouth a little bit, right Larry? Right, you chilling? You good? All right, there we go. All set. Three pigs eating in there and a Lulu's out here eating. Boom, got clean drinking water for all the pigs. Most of the time they just bathe in it. So I have one of these shallower ones that they can't bathe in and it'll stay clean. They drink out of these. This is their favorite mudding spot, so I'm filling that up right now. They also have two other mudding spots in there. That is that. Swan's eating. Uh, the two ducks have eaten already. Let's sneak up on this amazing pool pond and see all the fish before they stir it up. Oh yeah. Check it. How sick is that? I love this pond so much. 
They're all waiting. They're, all of them are right here for me to feed. I gotta do a feeding of all my fish here soon. That, that pond is like the coolest thing ever to feed. Putting tilapia in there with your hands is like another level. So if you wanna see me do that, just let me know in the comments down below and I'll be sure to do that. It is so hot out right now, I'm going right back inside because I'm wearing jeans. By the way, look how big these chickens are. They're huge. Here are the axolotls I was talking about at the pet store, but these are, these are mine right here. There they are, crawling around. Today's positive comment shout out goes out to Michael Joseph. Been here since the DIY project videos. I love the videos and positivity you share. Hope I went, hope I could win a positive comment shout out for that. P.S. I'm Filipino. And by the way, representing all Kaferos from Asia. That's pretty dope. Appreciate that, Michael. If you want to win a positive comment shout out and have your comment on the screen in one of these upcoming, I can't say it unless I say it fast. In one of these upcoming videos, drop a positive comment down in the comments down below. That's very possible. Of course, if you have not done so already, join the family. There's a subscribe button down below. Smash it, hit the subscribe button for me, and after you do that, click the bell so you're notified every time I upload. Thank you, Kaferos, for watching. Check out the PC merch, top link in the description. And as always, Kaferos, until next time, I will see you in that next video. Peace. Come on. Where are you going?